questions about our covers that we made for our windows to protect them when we're going through scrub. Uh, so what we did is we made just basic straight piece of canvas and in the ends I sewed in some plastic tube. It's a rigid tube. So how the system works, I'm a bit high challenge so I can't actually read so I'll just push. So on the sides here you can see that Ian Sikaflex some sail track on. So what happens is we slide the plastic tube into there. So what we'll do now is we'll swap over so that Ian can put it up. I can't reach. So because I can't actually reach that high up the truck, Ian's going to demonstrate how it's done now. So those plastic tubes that I showed you slide into the sail truck. It's a bit fiddly. And generally we'll do it together, which makes it a little bit easier. So he's got it in both sides now and then he just slides it up all the way. And there we go, it's on, window protected. Well, I'll have a look at some of the detail that we had in here. So on the side next to the window, Ian has Sikaflexed on some sail track. Just aluminium sail track that you can buy anywhere, Bunnings or anything. Um, and then the canvas slides in those really rigid rods and that's what holds it really nice and firm and tight. We've used a ripstop nylon canvas and it's a heavy gauge so that gives it more structure and rigidity as well. I don't think this system would work if you used a soft canvas. You can see how scratched it is but it has absolutely no rips or tears or anything but all those marks would be on the window instead of on the canvas. I'll see if I can reach to take it out. No can do it. <laughs> Hang on. There you go. And it's out. If you have a close look at the windows, you should be able to see some of the scratches that are there. That happened the very first time we took the truck out. And um, yeah, we came straight back and made the covers. The other great thing about this design is it's really compact. So fold it in half. You can see how stiff it is, it's a bit difficult to handle. But you just roll it up and it just tucks away. This is the other side of the truck and this is our big window. You can see we've got very, the same system on this side. The sail track is a little bit further away from the windows and that's because when I made the canvas, I made it bigger than the window. Uh, it's really important that you stick the sail track on after you've made the canvas so that you can get that perfect tight fit. You'll notice on the truck here we have another bit of sail track that has been sicker flexed on what we use that for is to put an awning on so that we have shade on this side of the truck if we need it so, just slides in Ian helping me on the other side pulling. Okay, we're at the end. And then this comes out. So you just got one ten pole. Just basically comes out, peg it in. online 
ten dollars for a pair of ten poles and you've got an Easter awning. On the other side, we have the same thing. It's just a short one. This covers over the um, cooking area. So if we're only pulling up overnight and we're going to be there for a couple of hours in the morning, we'll put that up instead of putting the big awning up.